Hi everyone, welcome to Narish Technologies. This is Srinivas. In this session, so we are going to discuss one interview question in Core Java collections. So, that is how elements will be stored into hash table. Here, how how elements elements store into hash table into hash table is the question. First of all, so what is the advantage of using hash table? This means generally if you take the linked list, in the linked list if you want to store some elements, for example, I want to store 17, 17 right that is connected to another one for example, 32 and that is connected to another example like 70 another node is a 76 is connected to 9 is connected to 81 is connected to 93 some elements are present. So, this is just consider it is a linked list in the linked list elements will be stored in the form of nodes and here it is a means what all the elements will connect like this in a linear form it will be connected. And here what are the disadvantages of linked list means the main disadvantage accessing become very slow. So, because there is no index to access and next one we should travel from one location to another location to process a particular element in the list. To avoid that problem they introduce the concept of a hash table. Suppose so in a hash table so here it is we are maintaining the hash table with a particular size here it is a hash table size only just to explain I am taking the size is a 6 the index just like array and hash table size is a 6 hash table size is 6. Now, how the elements will be stored into the hash table? How? the elements will be stored in the hash table means just with the help of one formula. So, what is that formula? Here that element we need to perform mod operation with the size of hash table then it will give the location. Suppose the same elements we are storing right here it is a 17 is one element 32, 76, 9, 81, 93 these are elements what is the size of hash table means here we considered 6. So, here 17 mod 6 value is a 5 the location is 5 and next 32 mod 6 here it is a value is 2 76 mod 6 value is a 4 9 mod 6 value is 3 value is 3 and here it is a 81 mod 6 value is 3 93 mod 6 value is 3 value 3. So, means what mod operator always will give the reminder. So, these are the locations from where we have to connect these elements in the hash table first of all 17 17 you should connect from the location 5 from the fifth location we need to connect 17 next 32 is from the second location 32 is from second location next 76 is from fourth location 76 and next 9 we need to connect from the third location 9 and next 81 also we need to connect from the third location and 93 also we need to connect from the third location like that the elements will be connected from the hash table. So, what is the advantage means for example, here in the linked list I want to search for the element search for the element is 81 81. So, from the first location so we should travel so, node by node we need to travel and somewhere you will get but here it is in the hash table if you want to search for an element element is 81 so simple with the help of with the help of here it is the size of the hash table 
you need to perform element mod size so you will get the location same story location here it is 81 mod 6 means what is a location is a 3 so here you need to search only only from means what from all the elements which are connected from the third location only in this area you have to search no need to search in the remaining locations so first here it is you will search for 81 in the first iteration is not available in the next location you will get right here it is it's a bit faster so when compare with the linked list processing the elements so become is a bit faster when compare with the linked list so that is the difference between linked list and as well as a hash table and how the elements will be stored in the hash table why they introduce the concept of hash table means so means what searching of an element or processing of an element become e easy when compare with the linked list hope you understood for more videos please subscribe to narayshati channel thank you Thank you.